Good morning, everyone. It's Thursday, March 10th, 2022. It is the week of the, after the first Sunday in Lent. This morning, the psalm is Psalm 50, verses 1 to 15. That's Psalm 50, verses 1 to 15. The Lord, the God of gods, has spoken. He has called the earth from the rising of the sun to its setting. Out of Zion, perfect in its beauty, God reveals himself in glory. Our God will come and will not keep silence. Before him there is a consuming flame, and round about him a raging storm. He calls the heavens and the earth from above to witness the judgment of his people. Gather before me, my loyal followers, those who have made a covenant with me and sealed it with sacrifice. Let the heavens declare the rightness of his cause, for God himself is judge. Hear, O my people, and I will speak. O Israel, I will bear witness against you, for I am God, your God. I do not accuse you because of your sacrifices. Your offerings are always before me. I will take no bull calf from your stalls, nor he goats out of your pens. For the beasts of the forest are mine, the herds and their thousands upon the hills. I know every bird in the sky, and then the creatures of the fields are in my sight. If I were hungry, I would not tell you, for the whole world is mine, and all that is in it. Do you think I eat the flesh of bulls or drink the blood of goats? Offer to God a sacrifice of thanksgiving and make good your vows to the Most High. Call upon me in the day of trouble. I will deliver you and you shall honor me. Oh, good morning, Becky. Nice to see you. See you very soon too. So this morning, Psalm 50 verses one to 15. You know, it talks about offering God a sacrifice of thanksgiving. So it's not about the, the uh, sacrifices. You know, when you think of what Israel used to do, offering sacrifices to God, it's not, that's not what God wants. And we hear it in scripture, of course, God wants, doesn't want our sacrifices, but wants a contrite heart, wants a new heart, wants a heart of flesh. God wants us to to offer ourselves to, to God in, in ways that are, are uh, thanksgivings to God, doing the works of God in the world, being, being a person who reaches out in love to help those in need and to, to honor God in what we do. You know, call upon me in the day of trouble, verse 15 says, I will deliver you and you shall honor me. All God wants us to do is to continue the work of Christ in the world. It's not about the being busy. It's not about doing things by the book. It's about offering ourselves, our whole selves to God. Because that's the sacrifice, as, God, as the psalmist says. That's the sacrifice of thanksgiving. To make good our vows to the Most High, it says in verse 14. So live a, live a life honorable live a life of compassion and caring. That's what God wants from us. That's what God loves. And God will deliver us, God says, in, in our days of trouble. So something to, uh, again, reflect on as we continue our journey through Lent. If you have time today, Psalm 50, verses 1 to 15. And let's just finish off with a prayer. Blessed are you, God of glory, you call us to give up all our vain attempts to reach you and to come before you in thanksgiving for your great salvation shown to us in Jesus Christ, our Lord. Hi, Martha. Nice to see you watching. Anyway, again, if you have a chance, so Psalm 50 verses 1 to 15, and uh, have a great day, and we'll see you next week as we continue our journey through Lent. Bye-bye.